A teacher and her boyfriend are killed in a car crash. The couple had just spent the day with family and were heading home on Sunday. Yeah, this happened in Orange County near Apopka Vineland Road and Dressage Drive. That's where we find News 6's Vanessa Ariza. Vanessa, you spoke with the victim's family within the past few hours or so. What are they telling you? Ginger, an absolutely heartbreaking story. The family all gathering and in tears. The brother-in-law telling me that that couple had just left a family member's house and they were actually here about to turn onto a, bop, a Popka Vineland Road when another vehicle came flying through, crashing into them. I thought I was going to give a speech for your wedding. Not for this. Bibi Mustafer is the aunt of 24-year-old Christina Bacchus. But for her, Christina was more like a daughter. I just think any moment she's going to pop out and she's going to ask me how I'm doing. Always a jokester with wit. She said Christina was always one to lighten the mood and a room. She had met her boyfriend, Bawani Jagmahan, in December and could see and feel the happiness between them. Christina and Bawani were killed Sunday night when an SUV crashed into them near Apopka Vineland Road. According to the report, the driver of the other vehicle was speeding and hit the driver's side. Bawani died at the scene. Christina was taken to Orlando Health, where she later died. The driver of the other vehicle was taken to Orlando Health in serious condition. I just don't know. Oh, my brother and my sister-in-law and my nephew, Alex, it's going to go on. The 24-year-old was a teacher at Parton Settlement Elementary School. She started as a substitute and worked her way up. Osceola superintendent said in a statement, quote, Our hearts and thoughts are with her family and her students at this very sad time. We have counselors and our crisis team at the school for support. And we also spoke with Christina's parents off camera, her mother telling me that Christina was their only daughter and that she had always wanted to be a teacher. Now, Osceola County Schools superintendent told us that a letter and personal phone call went out to former and current students, parents of Christina's. Coming up tonight at 6, we'll talk more about the couple and how a marriage proposal was in the near future. But for now, live in Orange County, Vanessa Ariza getting results, News 6. Vanessa, that's heartbreaking. Thank you.